Okay, I'm back. <laughs> what did Gemini even say? Free Gemini, it's never gonna happen, you guys. It's never gonna happen. It's it's never gonna happen. Who's gonna give me subs now? Seriously, is Twitch doing this to get back at me? Oh my god, Barty Gang really won. Where so who wants to step up as the new number one gifter? Who wants to step up? Seriously. Anyone? No one. You guys are so abusive. Okay. So to my knowledge, this show is just about like, about thank you, Case. No. To my knowledge, this show is just like the Tyra no. gives them challenges and they just have to do them, right? Play a game. I'm going to be playing puppet combo game tomorrow, I think. That's what I think it is. So it's just like a modeling challenge show. This is unbelievable that I'm here. I'm sick of the flip. Okay. Let's just get into it. Nude photo shoots? But they don't show anything, right? There's, yeah, they definitely Crazy. don't. I am like so excited. I can't believe it's like an opportunity of a lifetime. And sometimes I still think it's like a dream. This is unbelievable that I'm here. I'm from this really, really I can't see what their names are game. though, because it's mirrored. <laughs> this is gonna be hard. I'm not being here, but in another aspect, I'm kind of sad because my kids are kind of sick with the flu. And not only is mommy not there, but daddy's not there either. He's in Iraq. Wait. I can, fl hold on, I can flip it for you guys and then I can just watch it up here, hold on. Oh, is it horizontal or vertical? Okay, there, it's flipped, period. Opportunity of a lifetime and sometimes I still think it's like a dream. This is unbelievable that I'm here. I'm Becky! I'm really, really small town of only 180 people. Nobody I wants think to it's me, so sped up here. too. <laughs> I'm very excited is about it? being here, but in another aspect, I'm I don't think it is, girl. I'm sick of the flu, and not only is mommy not there, but daddy's not there either. He's in Iraq. <laughs> Flip well, your go, camera. Go, go, go. No, my nose. I'm not oh, doing God. it. My nose will it's look right weird. right there in front of me, and I'm just like, holy cow, she's so heat, whatever. It's so tall. Welcome to ANTM Flight 701. Who the fuck I'm is that? I'm your flight today, Miss J. In this business, you have to be up and Ms. ready for J. anything. Today, you will be going to your first photo shoot. <laughs> photo shoot already? I'm like, wait, let me, you know, freshen up and look all cute and stuff. Grab your bags Mountain and follow me. <laughs> follow me, ladies. So girls, you're gonna have to do a photo shoot, which is usually what happens getting off of the plane, going straight to location. And you're gonna have yeah, to don't give spoil me, it for me. Ten I've never incredible seen poses. How's it going? Understand the mood, please. I'm just gonna do ten shots. All right, work it out, girl. Gorgeous. Come on. I've never done any kind of professional modeling ever. And all of a sudden, they're just shoving me in front of this camera and taking pictures of me. Okay, so AJ is like the alternative okay. girl of the season. Give me a little profile. Nice. I'm watching the other girls see what they're doing. Next. They just seem really nervous, unsure of themselves. I just think at 23, I just have to I know I want to do this. She's pretty. Melrose is pretty. Thank you. Mag. I'm not going to lie. It was intense. I was trying to get up there and just show my stuff. Okay, here we Ginger? go. Ginger? Her name is fucking Ginger. Turn in right there, perfect. <laughs> Girl! Brittany looks like a I'm Brittany. I'm really free-spirited. I'm crazy. I don't care what people think of me. I don't at all. I do a lot of Parody? things that people normally wouldn't do. Yeah. <laughs> Carrie? Point it out, girl. Leangela. I want to like show America, hey, I can do it. And show. The first Indian chick to be. They're all so like, young. Oh. Let's smiley, get a little serious on Better. Next girl and hit it. So I was just like, you know, like doing my faces, being all serious. <laughs> I think I'm not there. Thank you.
It's just that like it was like all those names and then like Brooke. Michelle. And, and so we're both 18. And the toy kills a joke. What was the joke? You were saying 18, but like, I'm 18 too. Oh. Stupid. But if you think about it, it's like only one person. Girls. Like, I know. Is that high? Won, that she's still competition. That must be high. Like, oh, yeah. I know her better than I know any of you, so it's not all for it, over all of you. There's not a lot of, like, tall, thin, six feet twin models. At this like, point, it's hard to say, like, I feel like there is. Competing, but you are. We've always been compared and competed like all of our life. Like everybody's well, like, yeah, oh, who's more athletic? Like. Who's smarter? Da, 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 da. Like we always got a lot of like tall, well, thin models. The situation would be that we both like <laughs> and then I win. <laughs> I hate twins. Like, I don't know if any of you guys are this way here, but twins are a freak of nature, honestly. Twins are so disgusting. Like, the twins are, twins are just about The two twins of Yeah, they're not special. There's two of them. They're literally not even unique. I'm the top model. I'm Ron Harris, and this is Richard Harris. We are going to teach you a squirrel that's we talk taller. There's so many games in this show. I'm going to be like Tara. I'll be sweet. <laughs> Their voices are pitched up, yeah. <laughs> I can lower the speed, but it doesn't really bother me, honestly. Is this better? Is this better? <laughs> this is my favorite part of Top Model. Meeting the new girls every season, this is like what I live for. I'm looking at every single one of you like, I saw your tapes! I saw your tapes in your hometown! You're like, Tyra, I wanna be a top model! <laughs> We're gonna be doing some serious interviews, and I want you guys to be real. I want you, because I can see straight through the fake, like I say all the time. You just be yourselves, because that's what got you here. All right? And if you're nervous, I want you to come in that room and say, Tyra, I'm Honestly, I don't know anything about Tyra Bay. I don't even know why she's famous. Was she a model before she had this show? She was. She used to have an empire. I didn't I don't know shit about Tyra. Oh my god, good morning. How is everybody? <laughs> Who is I'm that? I'm in South Carolina, I'm 19. You say that you're sad that I've retired, but now what? But now I'm ready to take your spot. Can you give me your best Tyra Banks pose? There was one pose that she did, and she had her shoulders arched, and she had her head up. Oh, Tyra ate and not. I know exactly what this is. I know what she's talking about, too. Yes, I do. She did a little pose like this for the hand over Oh, yes, she did. Okay, Tyra could have ate. Signature classic Tyra Banks over the shoulder. Did she have beef with Naomi Campbell? feel like I just need oh, like when I think of Tyra Banks she's got it the it fact I think of call. like I just need somebody to stuff up and give me a chance ah, drugstore hi. makeup model <laughs> like she'd like be like a, a Pantene Hello. model my name's or Carrie something. D oh my god Carrie Jay, D just do it for me please oh, oh my god oh. there's even some spit on her leg now oh. 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 who is this who is that? Is that a name though? I, just I don't want to be rude. For you. Don't ever do this ever again. I was just very, very nervous, especially coming from North Dakota. Like the most famous person we have in North Dakota is Colombian. Oh, no. Does anyone know? Dead. You know who you remind me of? Who? Rebecca Romaine. Oh, thank you. Oh, gosh. I'm weird. <laughs> I'm kooky. I'm oh, actually yeah. really high strung and just out there. I'd do it. Okay. What was that? Oh. Girls is not drag race. Hi, my name's Anchel. I'm 19, 19 year old. 19. I'm so freaking nervous. Why did you choose blue contacts? I've always wanted different color eyes. Do you think there's something culturally in America or even in your own country that is telling you that lighter <laughs> eyes are so In India, they do believe that lighter Less than 333. Are I actually want to beat that. Be like, hey, I'm dark, I'm beautiful, and, I can, and I'm Indian. So I don't have to be light skin or light colored eyes to be beautiful. But at least you know. That's the power of at least knowing. Like, I know I'm such a slave with this damn thing on my head. It's the first step. Next step is me sporting a fro. I'll get there. But you've done that. I did. For a hot second. I want to make a difference. I want to get out there and be like, She has the Yiddish. Go out there and be who you are. People Yiddish. don't realize that it goes across every single culture, this whole color thing. I, I think she's gorgeous. I agree. Oh, God. 
So you say, Ew. Michelle, that you are the top They're boy so the trashy. Uh, yeah, definitely. I've always been more into sports. How so are they that's models? So that's when you YouTubers. came in touch with your masculine side. Yeah, I think so. Jay, when did you come in touch with your feminine side? At oh. birth. <laughs> We're very different. We're not trying okay, to be different. Okay, no offense. They're no, Anna. We're not trying to be different, though, either. They're literally Anna. Anna. <laughs> <laughs> that was hilarious. I love oh it. Oh my god, you guys did the same thing. Why are you copying me, clone? Clone's got two left feet, one got two right feet. <laughs> Thank you. And they do look very different up close. The closest they need to be to fashion is sitting in a back it, row. They're not going to make it, girl. They're not going to make it. Let me just say that. A-N-T-M-7. A little piece of heaven. Oh, she's a queen. Did I knock you off your feet? Girl, you knocked me off my feet, off my chair, and everything above and beyond. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Why are you so happy today? Shaylee Woodley. So alive, I feel like just on top of that world, you know? But you describe yourself as dark and intense. The kind of music I listen to, it's very dark and deep. I love heavy metal and rock and roll. When you put that swimsuit on, I want you to come back, and I want you to rock and roll, runway, walk. She had a pretty, you know, like that hooded Honestly, eye that's very okay. sultry. This is the game right uh, Are they supposed to be bad? Like, I don't think any of them have walked good. And all their bodies look like so weird. Maybe the standard was just different. So that's why I think that. But like, just so easy they to say all no. look a mess. Oh, really? Girl. When she came close, I said maybe. My name's Jada, I'm 18, and I'm from Parkersburg, Iowa. You say that at your school, people give you a lot of compliments and that you're definitely the hot girl. People, you know, wow, you're beautiful, you know, guys, the like the football girl. team. So when the football team, did get caught in a huddle? No, yeah, a couple times. Well, I... Oh. <laughs> a lot of the times, the hot girl on campus doesn't translate into a model, and she gets her feelings hurt. Where do you think you fit? I think I'm a hot girl that can model. I didn't come here okay, she's to sit and be quiet. I came here to get myself seen, and I only have a week to do it. I think she photographs nice. <laughs> Who hey, the Becky? fuck is Pretty this? Pretty much all-around American girl. Who's that girl that sings bubbly? It's such a bunch of girls. In my baby book, it says, when my parents asked me when I was three years old, it says that I want to be a model. My mom's like, oh, no, 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 honey. You raise pigs. <laughs> We're not going to be a model. I'm like, I'm going to be a model. I was not going to give up. I'm ready to be a mixed sex She doesn't look anorexic. She's kind of generally sweet, generally Kobe pretty, Kauai, generally nice. Thank you. I do see general model. You, it can be generally boring. Monique, 19 years old. Are you excited to be here? Y'all trying to give me a heart attack on here. <laughs> you need to pick me. I deserve what? it. I really deserve it. Why do you deserve it? I've been through so much from life and oh my God. from like my childhood and... Out of all my sisters, I've always been the darker skin one. They will always talk about me like, oh, you know, black you love. And I used to tell my mama, tell me, I'm so black lady. Thank you, Shirley. Hey. How are you? One thing that a lot of girls do that come from troubled backgrounds is they try to enter the entertainment industry because it gives them some type of validation. I want big things out of life. I want to just go as far as I can, as far as my mind takes me. If you enter this competition or the modeling world in general, they're going to be saying your hair is this, your nose is that. Day after day after day, you can bring back those same emotions that you had as a little girl, and sometimes even worse. It's a chance that I'm going to take. I swear that reminds me of a swimsuit I had. About 10 years ago, I had a swimsuit calendar. shot she not? And my body used to look like that, too. Work it out. She looks like a little... Yeah, 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 one serve. I really like the twins, but I don't know. I think they need some serious grooming, though. I guess that's their age or whatever, the twins, but only one person could win. So why are they holding on to each other so much? Oh, she's okay, working Eugenia. Hi, my name is Eugenia. It says here that you don't like the last season of America's Next Top Model Girls. <laughs> they're boring. It just seems like they're really generic, like Gina. She was too innocent. So who's boring here? The twins are boring. I don't know their names. That little rocker chick, it just seems like there's only one side to her. What are you about? I'm straightforward. Clearly. <laughs> <laughs> okay, she's kind I of a queen. Like I like Eugenia. The women she's kind of a queen. Like. Do you think you're likable? Yes, I'm likable. Because yeah. <laughs> I don't think so. I'm very caring. <laughs> oh. Y'all don't believe me? No. No, I say things that are mean, but in moderation. Uh, there was no moderation here today. Ah! Oh, my God. Oh. Hi, guys. Woo! Hi, my name is Brittany. 
I would be the type of person you wouldn't expect. Do you have any talents? I tap dance. You tap dance? Yes. I want to be America's next top model. Left, Wait, right, what is oh. <laughs> Give us a split. I want this so badly, so please pick me. All right, I wrote it just for you. Don't get the beat. Intelligent and classy, I got a cute little booty. Not only brains, I got the beauty. Confident, but I'm not cocky. I'm going to the top. Don't you try and stop me. Oh, oh my god, she has swagger. Oh. She has so much swagger. Stop it. Stop it. I'm Brooke. I'm 18 years old, just a baby. I am giving up end of my high school year to be here because guys this is my dream you gotta sacrifice for what you want and i really 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 want this she's five seven but she's i see no miss eva the diva was short but she was america's sex top model because that personality brought her through she's my name's drunk. megan i'm 22. this, this is, is the is first real opportunity that's presented itself as far as modeling i know this you've had a very traumatic something happened to you and your family so why don't you tell us that story when I was nine, I was in a plane crash. We took off, <laughs> and it was hailing, and it was windy. Oh. The plane, it started kind of rocking. The last thing I do remember was I kind of looked at my mom for comfort. What happened was we actually crashed in like a huge open field. Oh, wow. My mother, she eventually died in the airplane with hypothermia. She happened to be partially on my body, so it was enough to keep me alive for warmth. You think she's an angel oh, for yeah. you? Now? Yeah, like my mother was such a wonderful person and very giving and caring to everyone. She's probably here right now. She's just gonna say the exact same thing. She just guided you right She's here. She's in here somewhere. It's definitely opened my eyes up to how quick things can change in life. How, you know, for the better or for worse. I mean, for the better, here I am. I really hope to make it to the top. <laughs> hey, hi. Uh. Rapunzel, Rapunzel. <laughs> my name is Evita. I'm 20 years old. I have two kids and I'm married. My husband's in Iraq. And how is it like okay, being without well. him right now? <laughs> It's become easier I because I've adjusted to I want this more than anything. And I'm not going to let that dream go just because I have a family. When was the last time you cut your hair? OK, that answers my question. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> that was an emotional question that you asked. Yeah, I know, because did you see her face? Her hair like, looks good. <laughs> what is this gay boy talking about? You know, I always thought about having an all-American family, like the That's soldier and like, then the model honestly. and then the two little kids. This is what I need to do for myself. This is like an <laughs> I don't think it's a right for Amita to be here, hey, especially baby. when her kids are really young. I'm getting mad right now, just thinking about it. I'm not going to sacrifice watching my daughter take her first crawl or watching her eat her first food, you know what I'm saying? For nothing. I'll be in that house. And if watching I'm leaving my kids, I'll be the last girl standing. Food? I want to show people what it's oh, like to be queen. different, because I'm different. Nice Real different. Flag. You survived cervical cancer. So many people have it worse, but it was a, it was an emotionally hard thing for me to go through. It's actually more common in women than people think. One in three women who are sexually active will get the virus that causes cervical cancer. Why do you want to be America's Next Top Model? I want to show people that you don't have to be the typical blonde. Recent events in my life have led me to realize that she I can do anything. She's eating. I love the way she loves this girl. I love her height. Ugly She's one buddy. of those. I, I she like her. Swirl, baby, swirl. World. I'm a little nervous about meeting Ugh. the panel, but I hope they're gonna be thinking she's gonna be America's next top. Those eyebrows. Where do you work? And that I work at Jezebel's. I'm an entertainer. Oh, okay. Yeah. Jezebel's at the st stripping. I'm not a stripper. I'm an entertainer. Big difference. It's another part of modeling in a way. Really, it's another part of the fashion world. But no, it's not. I mean, like to me, it is because I just want to be clear with you that stripping is not a part of modeling. I'm not judging you. For, I'm not judging you for being an exotic yeah. dancer or a stripper. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But yeah. it's 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 not modeling. I just hope they don't get the wrong impression because I love being me, so learn to love me. <laughs> Those ears. <laughs> Loving the stash. Loving Thank the stash. I, I think she'd be mom. happy stripping. Like Jezebel. Because it's the same as mom. Mm. Oh, oh, oh. Tyra Banks, oh. wind in the hair thing. <laughs> Okay, girl, calm Hi, the fuck my down. My name is Jocelyn. I am 19 years old. Did you learn all that in Catholic school? <laughs> <laughs> I should be America's like time out because I devote myself to this. Every day is like a fashion opportunity. I can portray so many different looks. Give me some looks. What looks can you portray? I can give you neck. What do you want? Neck? What else? Seriously? Give me sexy. Give me sexy lingerie. Give me catalog. What was that? Resting? Hi. Oh my god, so happy. <laughs> How are you guys? Lovely seeing you. Hi. <laughs> Look at 
she's got the queen. She's got the queen. Oh. I don't think she looks drag. She's I think she's just a drag personality. Work it, girl. That's oh, that's fierce and sick. Yes. Hello. How are you? Your name is Melissa Rose, but you go by what? Mel Rose. Why is that? I don't need that Issa. No Issa. It's too much. People don't remember Melissa Rose. I'm Melissa Rose. I'm a country singer. They remember Mel Rose. I need to show America what real top models are and what women She's that really want pretty. are like. I can be your best friend or I can be your worst enemy. Pick or choose. What does that mean? It means that I can be really nice and I can be a complete bitch. Well, that I can see. I love high fashion so much. I made a lot of the clothes that I'm wearing here. Can you name top fashion designers that are really relevant to the industry right now? Chanel, Derek Lamb, Frenza Schuler, Zach Posen. You know, you passed, though. You, I you. am very impressed. My name's Leangela. I'm from Columbus, this Ohio, outfit. and I'm 21. So you were the first African-American homecoming queen in your town. When I won, everyone was like, oh, you deserve it. You know, everyone you, gets Pisces. along with you. You like everyone. You so Talk much. about your relationship with your mother and being dropped off at the child this protective is season service. Seven. We, at the time, were just coming out of staying in a homeless shelter, and she just dropped me off. She was like, you know, I'll, I'll come back and pick you up. But she never came back, so. How old were you? I was like 10. I did stay in foster care. This for could a few happen months. to me, you guys. It was probably the worst time of my childhood. I've been from homeless to homecoming queen, this could you know, in a to lifetime. Me. I hope this that's not the high point of my life, you know? I want to take it to a higher level. Honestly. If Leangela made it to the next round in this competition, it would almost give her that boost of confidence. And I think we would see her just take off. Awesome. I'm Ginger. I'm just turned 18. I worked as a page for the House of Representatives to find a bitch from Mama so Mia. The Republican side, so that's pretty conservative. And this fashion industry child, they got gay boys and six. How do you think you can deal with that? I'm not afraid to get out there and meet people. I'm not afraid to see what's different. You are standing on that pulpit and you are saying the things that you think are correct. But I think that there is a girl underneath there that does not have this veneer. Who the hell are you? I am Ginger. Keep talking. Really hard. I've done ballet my whole life. Talk like this. This has been an awesome experience in... <laughs> Drop it like it's hot. She's like, ew, it has drop. a disease. Okay, keep it's talking. Gay. Yeah, what else? Give me a head flip. Go down and up. What makes you better? I am better because I know how to get through hard things. I know how to bring it, and I know how to walk down that runway. Work it out. <laughs> God, there's so many. The time has come that we have to make our first cut. This is really nerve-wracking. They might put How many again? in there, or they might put just one or neither. There is a salon behind us, and inside that salon, you will find 21 magazines with Tyra on the cover. In each of those magazines, there is a photo tear sheet. And Lord help you if you're not inside one, because... Those 21 magazines represent the 21 young ladies who are going to continue on in the competition. Are you ready? Yeah. Well, I feel like all the ones I'm I didn't show were gonna get Because for some cut. reason, I always get trampled at this point in time. On the count of three. One. Two. Three. Like, all the ones we saw are gonna stay in. Like, are we even gonna know choose. anyone it's who like gets cut? Prayers and blessings is just everything. I'm extremely excited. I'm gonna be a super mom, I'll still be a mom and a wife, but times 10. <laughs> Who got cut? Hey, I didn't make it, but it's cool. Oh, we love to you, baby. You oh, the exotic I'm gonna dancer. Keep on loving myself. I ain't gonna let this be a downfall for me. That's being a sore loser, and I ain't no sore loser. These girls are weeded out, and now here's my real competition. Let's get it on. Let's focus. Throwing you guys oh right into work. God, so what we're gonna do is send you girls to a very important photo shoot. Oh, I love taking photos. I am so stoked to go take a photo shoot and actually like get started with this competition. We have makeup and hair extensions here so that you I'll girls can away. bring your look together. Now we're gonna give you guys 15 minutes to get ready. Oh! 
this is the risque shoot. I feel like it'll be photo or uh, sensor. I'm gonna try to stay focused and do everything I have to do, you know, to stay on top. Clearly, you guys have not gone through the hair and makeup beauty school. But what the who fuck took are these hair ways? They're actually gonna help you out this morning because the thing I didn't tell you is today you girls are going to be shooting nude. wrong to expose your private parts for people to see and i just can't do it have fun well bitch you don't have a choice for those who took advantage of those hair extensions they're actually going to help you out this morning because your private girls parts what is she nine i'm from a small town and i'm a good girl it's just really hard for she's crying me to know, like, that i'm gonna do this and like fulfill my dream but go home and have so many people mad at me it's important to understand that nudity in a shot can be very very classic and there's a fine line between I sleazy think the, versus I think the sexy short oh, has gender issues. Is now you guys are in great hands today brian is your photographer Honestly. What's the issue? Tell us. I, I just can't pose in the nude. You can't? Realize that it's going to affect your standing in the competition. That's all I can say. Ginger clearly won't even get naked in front of herself. So, I mean, there's no way in hell she's going to do it in front of all these people. Right, Melrose. I want to see confidence. I think there's a ferocity in my that eyes. That fucking wig. And I think wig. it'll come out as a really intense picture. That fucking wig. I freaking just put on a top of a hotel station. Monique. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, she's eating. This is really, really weird, but I'm excited. I can't wait to see the picture. Monique is eating. I'm scared out of my mind. Like, if anybody should be worrying about, like, getting naked, it like, definitely should be me. Like, my kid is going to be watching this one day and be like, there's my mom naked. Honestly, I wonder if it's cold up top of that. Like, what if the girl who was in a plane crash is like triggered by the hypothermia? I her mom. would be. Okay, that's nice. Okay, ready? No, she's Here we go. Hand to live well. I know, I was like, long ass hair to cover her boobs. Like, what's yeah. going to cover my boobs? If you really right. want this, this shouldn't be no problem. That's just because, like, I don't feel comfortable being naked doesn't mean that I don't want it, like, more than anybody, you know? It's just that I'm not. Well, you're I wasn't raised like this. But you're obviously not doing what it takes. Did I not say I wasn't going to do it? I'm going to do it. Oh, okay. well, no, what are you talking about? Oh, the drama. Like, it's a hard thing. I'm not just going to be, like, walking around naked, be like, woo, you know? Like, I feel great because I don't feel great. But I just hope I have a place to go to home to, you know? And that's what's hard for me. I'm going to want to see confidence. Okay, if your confidence family's going to disown you, you then don't it's fucking like do it. Like, I don't know. It is not worth it. Shoot. Nice. Okay, Becky, well. like, One, shut the two, fuck up. Nice. This girl is so cringe. Being a model, you have to be open. You cannot be sheltered. You can't do that then. It's a wig. Like, what was she thinking? Yeah. Man is going first. I'm first. She's a brave twin when it comes to these sort of yeah. um, naked experiences. Her sister is just watching her be naked. I guess it's like looking at a mirror, right? One, two, three. Good. Oh, she's going very artistic. Let's keep going. Looks like a bird. This is tastefully done nude photo that pretty much glorified the human body, and there's nothing wrong with that to me. Ginger, you're up. Wait, didn't one of them get cervical know, cancer know, from an STD? Should they know. really be sitting on the same Thank platform? You. I'm what gonna expect that these spread? girls wanna be models, but they're like objecting at the fact that they've gotta be nude. You know what I'm saying? I really don't wanna hear it. Great, perfect.
Oh, One, two, three. Ginger. Yeah. We can do it so you're totally covered the whole time you're up there. You have somebody go up there with you. You know, leave her alone. She don't want to do it. Big deal. <gasps> Is she going to do and it? She couldn't do it, but we had talked to her, and she finally made up her mind. Good. God hates you now. God literally hates you now. When it comes down to it, it's not important to me just to win something. I'm going to stick to my morals and standards no matter what. Well, she only took two pictures. I don't think it's fair to everybody else. I feel that she should get automatically eliminated. So we got our semi finalists. God hates you now. know what we have to do now. We've got these girls and we've got to narrow it down to, to the finalists. All right, well, let's start with Meg. I'm going to be honest with you, she was not my favorite. But she's kind of like, yeah. yeah. Yeah, Angela. Look, she looks like a model. Ew, I'm gonna say I love Leangela's airport shot. There is such wait, a sensitivity. Oh, let's say, this is not her, her new shot. Person. She wouldn't have been Mad Max. But wait, okay, I'm not mad at that. I just wish I get so much pressure. She is. Alrighty, up next, Megan. She told us a very powerful story. She looks pretty. When I was nine, I was in a plane crash. I think she can <laughs> handle this business, but I'm a little nervous. Meg looks at pretty. Her proportions. Carrie. Personality wise, I think she's willing to go 199%. Oh, no, okay, let's see her close up. And what's up with the hair? Yeah, the Eugenia. wig. Up close, she's Ooh. Eugenia. But it's weird because when she's wrong, she doesn't even look like a model at all. And when she's right, she's really good. She is. Mel Rose. We like Mel Rose. Mel Rose. She reminds me of the girls from like the late 80s. But now I think we are moving to the 80s. So I think she could be a good shot. Mel kind of hair is huge. Christian. I love the fact that she understands the Tower Banks poses, the Tower Banks yes. ABCs. Let's just yes. take a close up look at Christian's nude because I barely, scarcely see a neck. I, I see, see head and shoulders. shoulders. All right, Brittany. Look at her face. There's a huge <laughs> question mark. Like, am I doing it? That could be taught. Jasmine. Cha Cha Di Gregorio, honey. Give me catalog. Oh. <laughs> they fucking set her She's feeling the wind in her face. I think Jasmine's like, are a bit serious? hard. Can she soften up? I'm on the fence. Ginger. I love Ginger's face. I gotta say. I do too. But she only did two frames. And so that's showing someone who's a little bit unwilling to cooperate. I mean, Indeed. she did two frames, but she looks better than some of the other girls. It's she like, did ten. Take so. the picture. That's it. There's nothing coming from her. But I think she looks like an amazing Native American, gorgeous beauty. Mm -hmm. AJ. I see a okay. great canvas to really Yeah, why did she say all that? Look at AJ's picture. Her <laughs> skin looks so alabaster and luminescent, but the face is <laughs> off. Ancho. Ancho looks oh, like a Miss World pageant winner. I don't think she's a model. When I look at her, it scares me how pretty she is. Jada. Well, I mean, oh, no. I think she looks a bit mad at you. But I think those masculine features, they photograph well because it's bone structure. She's more masculine than I am. Well, maybe she needs to... <laughs> She looks a bit special. Those masculine features photograph really well. <laughs> what? This poor girl is gonna have to watch this back. Is Becky? I like her cheekbones. I do like her face. I wouldn't know if this person would be behind all that. She looks, she like she looks her, kind of safe. But there's something in her eye that says "Don't sleep." Brooke. She looks a mess with that hair. A lot of girls when they step into this industry, Bill. they don't know how to style themselves. You Bill. had your mama, so she told you, uh-uh, honey, we're going to put the piece over here because your mom loves throwing a piece right on the back of her head, right? My mama does love a bun. I do think that Brooke has Bill. something. She raps, so she's got some flavor to savor. No Nick. Oh, she, she just made my eyes flutter. <laughs> Monique is the type of girl who could book cosmetic campaigns, high fashion editorials, Actually, and liquor. Uh, well, you don't want to say that, but no, literally. Amanda, one of the twins. Work. I love that she's just is giving energy and sex appeal because Amanda's the girly twin. I think she would be very comfortable to work with. Up next is Michelle, the tomboy twin. I like it. I like the wavy hair. She's just got that okay, model she face, ate that more, plain but still Jane not model face. If I had to choose one twin over the other, I would choose Amanda. And I would choose really? Michelle. Yeah. Would I would like choose the twins? Michelle. I love one of the twins. I just can't remember which one it is. Shut <laughs> 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 Okay, did, can they get rid of like this has three? Been a long week, it's hard for it? me to watch these shows. Yeah. There's so Lots many. Lots of girls. oh my gosh, like, what's gonna happen? Because if my name is called. My life can change. The first girl that I'm going to call. Like there's too many. 
Melrose. <laughs> Melrose City. Melrose City. The second name that I'm going to call. Moni. Moni. Really? Monique A. <laughs> Next I'm name. Sorry, Madison, don't rank. I lost my Nahida 50 50. This is my last day alive. Goodbye. Oh, but nah. Michelle, you see in shock? Yeah. Well, you have guaranteed Speechless. Yeah, I'm shocked too. Ah! <laughs> the next name. Moni. Her name is Whoop. Is she not sure? With that ugly ass wig, they're gonna pick her. The bar is on the floor yeah, in the I'm sewer. Here. Name. Thank you, Verlin. For the seven, I appreciate it. Anjo. Oh okay, you say a lot of people don't think that you're a beautiful woman, but there's a lot of people that do. Thank you. Oh my god. Hey, Jane. Hell yeah! What about Monique? Hey, <laughs> like, am I the only one who thought Monique ate? Next name that I'm going to call. Meg. Wow! Rock your own, baby! That feels good! Yeah. <laughs> the next name that I'm going to call. How many get sent home? Megan. <laughs> yes, gender queer. We love this non binary, sir. The next name that I'm going to call. Carrie D, come on up here. <laughs> the next name. Monique A. Amanda. <laughs> I know why you had that weird look on your face when I called your name. Yeah. You were like, what about the other one? <laughs> you guys both did a good job. I only have one name left. And that girl's name that I call, she'll have a one in a 13 chance of becoming America's next top. Monique A! The last girl that will join these 12 lucky ladies over here is... Monique! Oh, thank fucking God. Oh my God. <laughs> hurting so long about about being a dark-skinned black girl and there are so many brown sisters if looking at you if they caught her saying, i would have wow, been so mad because she and ate. That means i'm beautiful too congratulations you guys <laughs> oh the chops i'm just Honestly, coming home I'm because i'm a mama the models. compared to the other girls i sacrificed way more putting my girl, kids through worse mom really put though. my life on hold because i honestly thought that I was gonna make it. Yeah. I feel like I went against somewhere else when I did the nudity scene. But part of me wanted to stay. You got naked sad. for nothing, bitch. You're so embarrassing. You, shouldn't give up. you might as well have not done it, girl. You're literally so embarrassing. Like, what a loser. God hates her. She's disowned. No one loves her. And she's not even gonna be a model. Hell yeah, I'm ready. Bring it on. Get me naked there again. I'll do it again. Thank you, she found me. Hi. Missed your streams, Pete. It's like, America's next on model house. Yeah, baby. Another. 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 Yes. Okay. But I need to take my medicine. You guys can look at this flower pot. We're on Hollywood Boulevard, and it's almost surreal. We're starting. It seems like we're on a mission, and we'll, we're all walking together towards it. I am actually here. I always wanted to be like. Okay, who are your guys' favorites? Being so close to her was just like touching my dream. Hey. Hey. So congratulations on the final thirteen. Yeah. Yeah. So this is a gay boy. Today you will get a chance to stretch your stuff. I mean, like, duh. 
But first, we need some clothes, and that's where our guests come in. Girls, your design is for today, Elmer Avenue! Are they famous? Hi, ladies. We're the designers from Elmer Ave. Here's your first challenge. Please bring out the models. Yeah, what you're going to be doing out. is taking one of the guys that you that see, hair. you pick your man, and you take his outfit, feminize the outfit as much as you can. Make it yours, and make it look good. Then you need to remember, Elmer Ab is all about rock and roll. Oh, oh the rock and roll girl you better eat that. get on that stage and undress your man. Go! I wanted the first like, guy that came out, he's like really hot. The other girls were definitely looking at the men, but I'm looking at the clothes, like which outfit's going to fit. They're definitely rock and roll style. I thought it would kind of would give me an advantage. That's what I'm so used to. Whoa! Well, the style wasn't my style at all. I don't know nothing about rock. Eh, oh, she is. She is. And, uh, kind of... I got really nervous as soon as I got on the stage. All I have to work on is my confidence, and I have to work on my body. Next. No, she didn't really eat. I know you guys love her, but she did not eat. Did not eat. This is great, because runway has always been my forte. Okay, Christian kind of eats. Okay, Eugenia. Hi, Eugenia. Hi, Eugenia. Did not eat. Megan looks a mess. Once I hit the stage, I'm just, I'm bam, confident. I'm modeling. I just want to. Girl, you look looking fucking dumb, Melrose. <laughs> I really oh, believe Melrose I have what it takes to be my mom. I've been through things in Monique life that should have broke me. I think that's what a top model has Monique to have. They babe. have to have that strength. She's eating. All right, baby. Let's go. <laughs> Woo! Bravo! Smashing. Congratulations, girls. Some of you did an excellent job. Some of you, on the other hand, eh, maybe missed the mark a little bit. But we definitely all came to the conclusion that congratulations. Melrose, you win. What? Thank you so much. Melrose, Bitch, you did an excellent job. With clothes, you did a great walk. You will receive a great prize that will be revealed to you later. Thanks she again, ladies. She sucked Bye. ass. Are, Are you serious? And I'm like... I won. <laughs> that's all that matters. What was that walk? I mean, maybe that's what they wanted. Maybe they wanted we drama, not fashion. And there's a stretch of I guess they wanted the drama, movie. not fashion. Oh my god, it's decked this is our out. Ride. This is how Christian is supposed to be treated like a queen. Yeah, there you are. God, they're not even wearing masks. It's like COVID is going crazy. Oh my god, Tyra Mail. I finally know what Tyra Mail means. to experience some of mine. Your subscription has just arrived. We are on our way. <laughs> Flavor Flav had more budget. Tyra was broke at this point. Tyra's career was over by season seven. She was only booking L'Oreal. She had no budget. Oh, honey, the, the exclamation door, point goes before the uptime. And I'm like, oh, <laughs> made it. Idiot. Sorry, that was. <laughs> I'm so sorry. That was so uncalled for. Honestly, I'm such a beautiful person. Oh, oh this is God, a cute little vibe. Really this looks like a IMDU hangout. There's pictures of Tyra everywhere. It's kind of like a Tyra magazine theme for the whole house, oh which is really cool. Because we all want to be cover girls. Welcome to Tyra. 
the magazine dedicated to all you aspiring divas, billboard beauties, and runway showstoppers. Who might you know, give I a tip or two now viewer. that you've gotten one the in the door of the international me? fashion biz? I'm sorry. I created this publication for the fashion muses of tomorrow, who oh aren't afraid God. to go after their dreams today. That hair. Best of luck, and remember, if you have issues with an issue, don't just sit there. Tell me about it in the confessional. XOXO, Tyra. Ring, ring. Hello? Oh, yeah? You're so I get to live my wildest dream today? Are you yeah. serious? You guys, come on here! Oh, it doesn't know. <laughs> yeah, you have to do well. Yeah. <laughs> when if they come back up here and try and take my bed, I'll be like, no way. just went seven more games this break. We're only like 11 it. beds. Monique and Christian were the <laughs> unfortunate <laughs> losers in the bed situation. That means girls are going to have to sleep here. I am not sleeping on no bing bag. I will not do that. Pink. What it is. <laughs> I politely move their stuff and mark my territory. Oh. I don't want to sleep here now. I deserve a bed. So if I had to fight for my bed, I was going to fight for it. Tyra. Who's down this whip? Hey, that's my bed. Right Damn, you know, I don't know. I just decided to just hey. pee on the bed today. Oh. Did you do this? She said, yeah, I did. And she's gonna rub that it. Down the hall moment. That wasn't your bed. I don't know whose bed it was. It's my bed. It was some. It was. It was someone else's bed. Okay. <laughs> no, my bed. My bed. Uh -huh. Right here, underneath Tyrant. I'm oh. marking my territory. Monique, my bed. Bitch, so she owns everything. She was being a punk because she didn't tell me to my face that she was gonna try to take my bed. I wanted to fight her. Don't play with me. I'm gonna have a bed. I don't care. And they can call me damn diva, makes whatever. I don't care. You guys can all bite me. Okay, she's a queen. She's a queen. Yeah. Okay, excuse me. Before you use anything in this kitchen, I would recommend cleaning it. Mel Rose has tried to be the mom of the house, which a lot of people aren't feeling. Okay, the rule is I'm making this for everyone, but I'm not gonna clean the dishes, okay? Melrose. She found it upon herself to start cooking and telling people what to do to clean the dishes. Isn't she it's like 23? Like, She's so You're ancient. You're not my mother. Don't tell me what to do. Is anyone willing to clean these? Like, she is literally ancient. Why is she even there? She's too old to be a model. Like, honestly. Good morning. She's basically a What's grandma. Up, dolls? She's your age. You think I'm 23? Oh my god. Thank you so much. Oh my, oh my god, you guys. Shoot. I don't care what people's personal spaces look like, but I, I'm noticing that like garbages are overflowing. I don't know what to do about this. How is it overflowing? You've been there one There's, night. There's like little pockets of garbage everywhere. What about the bathtub? I'm chill. I think left it really nasty. <laughs> I don't want to be a mom here, but let's all like try and work together. We've only been here two days, and like our kitchen is nasty. Okay, so I guess the first thing is just like make sure in common spaces to clean up after yourself. Who likes to shower at night? Oh, God. oh I cannot shower in the morning. Absolutely. Who likes to shower in the morning? Let's just agree to not take like an hour in the shower. Exactly. Well, I'm gonna just say this because it, I, I will be sitting here lying and say, yeah, I will take a 20 minute shower because I know I don't take 20 minute showers. I take, take an hour shower at home, but uh, there's other people yeah. living here. You can't. We're not just, at home. Yeah. I'm telling you, I don't care. Who takes an that's hour just me. shower? That's just what I do. Like, what the fuck? Brush, what a waste of water. I still take a long shower. Honestly, we should all just stop thing. showering. That's it's just, just such a waste that's of what water. I do, so hey, sorry. This girl is so uncomfortable. Like, honestly, like, right now, guys. Right now, she doesn't want to compromise, and I don't, I don't like that. You just try and be, just try, try and era. do whatever you have to do while being respectful of all of us. I don't do that. I have a certain type of steps that I have to go through. Monique is cuckoo. There's something wrong with her. Melrose just wants to clean house. Then she can oh, fucking clean it herself. My oh my god, they got Tyra Neal. Okay, it says Tyra Mail. People think models are stupid, anorexic, drug addicted bitches. Are you? It's no! Like, yes. I don't get it. Yes. What? Oh my, like, what the hell is this? Well, I think that means we're doing a shoot tomorrow. We're not anorexic because I yeah. can't stop eating. At least half of them are in a wreck, like whether they know it or not. Like, let's be for real. <laughs> they can't do a drug addict shit. <laughs> oh, 
Uh-oh. Our, her reveals are not eating. Who are these young Already. Oh. Carlana Latina era. I am the only supermodel in the world! And I am almost 35, and I do not like young bitches! Tyra has completely gone off the deep end or skipped some meds or something. I am the queen! I am the I'm only queen. one person. What? What? Where is my wing? No, we're gonna get the... Where is what, my what, wing? What? 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 I've told you this woman needs wind constantly. Girl, help me blow! We need the wing! You are not beautiful like me! Get off! Okay, you know what? I am not returning to the set. Until all of these little peepees and bitches are sense. gone. Ah! 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 Bitch, you said you're 35. If you fall past 30, who knows if you'll even get back up? You better be careful, Mama. Seriously. <laughs> wasn't the real Tyra Banks. Yeah. You know, a lot of people probably think that that's how Tyra acts on a daily basis. You know, she was kind of portraying a model stereotype. Crazy diva, right? Oh. Well, today, we're going to do the most controversial so that's what that accent ever was. done a on America's model Next accent. Top Model. Oh. Today, we're going to do the most controversial shoot we've ever done on America's Next Top Model. Today, we're doing model stereotypes. And this is going to be a really tough shoot. So, AJ, you are going to be the model working the casting couch. <laughs> Amanda, anorexic model. Carrie D, the dumb blonde. All right, Brooke, the backstabbing bitch. <laughs> Christian, you're going to be a model. I mean, she fits the role. Actress. Eugenia, the black girl that the industry is trying to turn into a white girl. <laughs> Megan, the diva with a lap dog. Michelle, you're going to be the bulimia model. Oh. All right. Jada. The Why did they give the two Anna twins the eating disorder roles? Like, they gave both the twins the eating disorder roles? Like, what the fuck? And they are definitely anorexic. Like, they look anorexic. But... <laughs> Plastic surgery victim. Meg, you're going to be a bit of the drunk drug addict model. Okay, here we go. Ancho, the narcissist, okay? And Monique, you're gonna be throwing a cell phone at your assistant. <laughs> Melrose, you're gonna be the model that's not gonna wake up for less than $10,000 a day. <laughs> Drug addict, anorexic. You're gonna be the black one who they're trying to turn white. You're gonna throw a cell phone at your assistant. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> now I understand you won a challenge. So today, you get to be a diva for the day. You're gonna have a personal Ooh. assistant. You're gonna get some diva pampering of your own, like a little <laughs> massage. Oh, and God, thank you. <laughs> I had to get photographers that shoot amazing work. <laughs> hey, how are you going, guys? So this is Don and this is Bronson. They actually just flew in from Europe. And Yay. these are your victims today, all right? You guys ready? Yeah. So let's ready. pile up into hair and makeup. Okay, let's go. Yeah. How are you doing? Good, how are you? So I want to introduce you to Lindsay, who's going to be your personal assistant for the day. How about you? Now, be the diva oh, for the day. Have fun. Thank you. Thank you so much for the donation. I deserve it. You ready? Okay, I don't know what it's that though. It doesn't so, show up. Tell me you're throwing so, it at your so assistant sorry. and we'll add it to your photo later. I'll fix my donations. Okay, I promise. What did it say? Did anyone read that? You know what, Monique? You gotta give me some variety there because right now it's just two dimensional. Come on, Monique. It's still feeling cozy. Good. I won't get you mad. No, it did it, bitch. Shut up. Rising to the occasion. Get mad at me if you have to. Give it to me! Bitch, dumbass. Uh, uh, what did that look? Your last shot. I don't know. It's kind of like I would eat at this. Is that like, I, I literally model that someone's like choking me while I'm off wow. camera and I eat this is the it. Stuff I learned in um school. Yes. Yes, that's good. Boy, it's genius. Not, this is me throwing a thought at my assistant. Lucille Ball and Zany. Yes, last time, perfect. Thank like you. Like I ate. Meg, you 
I need ugly. you to give me that kind of strung out look. My stereotype Girl, was a drunk drug addict. Okay. Chick. It's definitely a stereotype, but I don't, I don't think it's true all the time. Right now, you're hunched so over, you just look like a big blob. Girl, she's playing oh, herself. I'm going to lose that gum, though, before we shoot. I brought it because white girls smack gum. Oh, that's not true. <laughs> get on set. My stereotype is black girls who get in the industry and they want to be white. She looks like Barbie. Oh, I love that. I love okay, that. She's eating, I think though. they really should portray African Americans just she the way they are, pretty. you know, in everyday life, and they never do. That's that I got standing up. That's pretty. That. Look at that genius work. I don't really see the whole trying to be white thing. It's because she has a blonde wig really? and a pink dress. Oh, wow. I love the body language. I love the art. Oh, she's eating, it. bitch. Yes. And then give me a little, come on, boys. Yeah, that's strong. That's powerful. Oh, she's I eating, I love girl. your expression at the end. Plane Tyra, crash is serving, girl. Either. Thank God she survived. A narcissist survived. loves she herself. Up. You lean back, you almost like, oh, you catch a reflection of yourself. I have to be like, yeah, it's all about me. Work it. Oh, she's so fucking well. eating, so bitch. Sexy. Which was really hard, since I really never think I'm beautiful. Last frame. Oh. Good. Remember, I want you to do you. I don't want you to give me the Tyra Banks. Uh huh. OK. Christian loves Tyra. She even said she to us, she can do the Tyra Banks pose. That's great to look up to somebody as an inspiration. Christian needs to find girl. her own image. Action. Let's see that emotion. You're crazy about this. Come on. Let me see it. Oh, she's Come on. Bad. Come on. The thing that frustrated me about Christian, she gave me the same pose. Shot after shot after shot. That was your last shot. From casting to now, I think Christian's giving me the same thing. Broke she down Tyra Banks. Me. Obviously, she's pushing her down the stairs. My role today was the backstabbing bitch. I like it. Which is okay, this is kind of camp. Polar this is kind of camp. Yes, that's. It was fun to get to play a bitch for you. I a like day. it. Oh, okay. camp. That's it. You need this job. This is going to make your career. Okay. Right. AJ was completely uninhibited and looked like a model. That's the one. Yes, I love that. I Put think that she's eating. Hot. That was your last frame. It was believable. Can we throw her in there? Jada, you are the surgery victim. You're all about Bitch, wanting to be perfect. Bitch, she's eating. Think about perfection. What surgery are you doing next? You're getting your face pulled. You've got your chest up. Oh, she I need you to is. really believe that. What are you thinking, Jada? And it's reading on your face. I understand the body position was a bit static, but Jada just gave me one face. That was your last frame. She is. In the beginning, Amanda was a lot more into it. She gets the anorexic thing and she just puts on a bikini. Is that because she knows she's anorexic? She's like, I can just go as myself! But I was just kind of like, oh, fine, I'll go with you for the whole twin thing. But now I'm a lot more into it as well. You wipe with one hand your face and the other one is like, get out. That's oh, nice. Oh, yeah! That. Head up. Oh, this is such a Yeah, I love it. Hey, Michelle, it looks really good. This is disturbingly amazing. I love it. Oh, yeah. Okay, genius, last frame. Look like a really Wait, she's eating and then model, throwing is, it up. You know, she's great. really giving. Ah, uh, hell no. Don't let me hang it. Now, Amanda, you're measuring yourself. Very, like, <gasps> straight up. No, straight up like a mannequin, tall and, like, erect. Tuck your hips under now. Amanda Wait, she doesn't ate. understand how to use her body. Right now, what you're doing is this, and it's boring. I need. Oh. Okay, there you go. You're gonna need the to spend a little girls time. are kind of cute. Okay, got the girl ready for Melrose. Melrose won her challenge. She had a personal assistant, had a massage, and I think a bit of that went to Melrose's head. I was waiting for her for about 10 minutes. Can somebody find Melrose? Yeah, bring her, bring her out. Yeah, I think you're overlooking. You're staring at it too long. No, really, stop it. Getting the massage with my makeup on really delayed me, and so I had to get my makeup redone. Should you be the narcissist? No. Okay. Is that Raja? Why is Raja on here? I want to be the perfect to walk into the shoot. <laughs> okay, Melrose, what's the issue? I've been waiting here. Oh, honey, I've been ready for like six hours, but then I got my massage with my makeup on, and then it came off, so they had to fix it. Really? You're the attitude right now? Just listen. 
don't slow up the shoots. All right, so let's jump in bed. I'm so sorry, you know, and then I just kind of, I didn't want to break down and cry, so I just shut myself off. People are throwing money at you all the time. How what dare this guy come again? at you with $9,999? Why you be like, oh, please get out. Is that horrified or is that bad acting? That's bad acting. Yeah, thank you. Can you get me horrified? Ah! That's bad acting. I need somebody to give me a certain I sense of vulnerability. Eat. And Melrose would not go there. I want you to think of something She's that absolutely right. horrifies you. I Let know yourself you guys are go. Liking Let her, open that door. Eating. You're acting. She's That's not crazy. eating, you guys. That's bad acting. Everyone's disappointed in me. I can feel the whole room is okay, disappointed. Okay, well, how can she focus when they're just like, you suck, bitch, suck, I die, like you're horrible. I'm going from like, she can't focus. Feeling like I'm the best, feeling like I'm the worst. <laughs> yeah, he's just mad at her. He's really bullying her. Woo! He's not being fair. Tomorrow you will have your first meeting with the judges. <gasps> Wow. Only 12 will continue on in hopes of becoming oh, America's okay, next so top we're going home. Love Love two we're going home. Love Tyler. All right, ladies, we got to get it together. Let's home. I think that performance-wise, I struggled today. I don't think that's really who I am, and I got a big kick in the ass. There's 14, I think. Right? Is that, is that so, ladies, how does it feel to be in this judging room for the very really? first time? What is it's that? crazy. It's crazy. Unfortunately, this will be one of you girls' last time in this room. But that's a while away. So we're not going to concentrate on that. What we're going to concentrate on right now are the amazing prizes. And the prizes are a little different this cycle. The first is a contract with one of the top modeling agencies in the world, Elite Model Management. Ooh. I was with Elite Models for a couple of years. The next prize you gotta is get back a with cover them. of Seventeen Magazine wow. and a six-page editorial spread in Seventeen Magazine as well. Wow. When I was 15 years old in the 11th grade, I remember booking Seventeen magazine, and it was the very first national big magazine that I'd ever shot for. I remember the photo Honestly, shoot. Honestly, who One did the best? One of the shots was me on this I'm pink scooter, and I thought I was fly. Uh, <laughs> I feel like girl last pushing is other girls down the well. staircase And that's a contract with win. Cover Girl Cosmetics worth $100,000. Right. So now it is time to meet your judges. The first is noted fashion photographer, Nigel Barker. The next judge is runway coach, Miss J. Alexander. And fashion icon and living legend, Miss Twiggy. So now it's time for your individual evaluations. And after that, the judges will deliberate and will determine which of you will be eliminated. So this week, you had a photo shoot where you had to evoke model stereotypes. <laughs> and Megan, you are first. Oh, she ate. All right, so Megan, here is your best shot. She ate. Well, Megan, you've completely owned this photograph. It's a really a great first shot. Can we see close up? Close up isn't so great. <laughs> the lights caught your back eye, but not your front eye. You can learn to do that at home in the mirror. Actually. Okay. Well, they should have picked a different picture then. Like Damn. You get a little piggy. Up, Derek. Yeah. So you have to make sure that when you go up, it's more to the side. Okay. Up next is Monique. And here is your best shot. <laughs> Why couldn't the white girl throw the phone? <laughs> the problem I have with this photo, I mean, I look at the lady in the suit, and you should have been much more in the forefront for me. I would have preferred to see a little more anger. Unfortunately, this looks just crazy. Oh, you gave anger, but you gave... <laughs> you gotta remember that the face has to be attractive. This is the money, okay? Go back over there. She flops. Carrie D. <sighs> Oh, you really went for it with the finger in the mouth and everything, huh? Carrie, did you <laughs> no. I was very proud of you. You gave stupid, you gave idiot, you gave clueless, yeah. you gave so many different types of dumb. So don't you guys like that? Like, I don't know how to take they it They love it? Can you help me take it off? Sure, let me just show you. <gasps> like oh my gosh, you're so smart. <laughs> what you have to concentrate on is... You already have the personality. Uh -huh. Some of the other girls, they had the model thing down, but they're just dead personality. Okay. So yours is the opposite. Okay. It's almost like pulling back a little and focusing on the 
Okay, the beauty. You gave okay. somebody Thank types you. of dumb, and you Up already next. have that. Anshul. All right, Anshul, so why don't you take down your hair? You're so much more modely now. You're one of the most beautiful women I've seen in a long time, but it's the type of beauty that almost is too pretty. So you have to fight against your beauty so that you're not Miss World, but that you're Miss Top Model. What? She is a narcissistic model that has just her face in all the mirrors. Shit. Well, Anshul, I remember you walked into casting with blue contacts in your eyes. In India, they do believe that lighter eyes are prettier. How do you feel looking at she yourself is. with dark eyes? And is she photo? saying it she's too pretty to be a model? Because, in a way, I think I was hiding behind them. I'm glad. I'm yeah. crying again. OK? Nigel, yeah. you being Indian, how do you um, well, that's a, respond that's a, to that? You know, you are beautiful the way you are. We are all unique in our own way. Nigel, you're Indian. What do you think about this? <laughs> and it's that uniqueness that makes people beautiful. All right, thank you, Anshul. Thank you. Meg, I do think this is a lovely dress to go to like a, a luncheon <laughs> and your hair, Meg, what's this? What is going on? You don't look like a model. This is like too wide here. We need to see more skin here. And this is too much going on here. There you go. <laughs> You look ugly, right don't be in front of me. Oh, she looks busted, yeah. but a great busted. I was trying to look all strung out. Girl, guess what? <laughs> I don't think you did a bad job. This shot does not bother me, but your film, Meg, there's something that happens to your face on film where it just gets flat. For the photograph, we've got to see your she eyes. OK, give me a model face. Look how that is so beautiful. Yeah. If you is continue it? after today and you aren't conscious of that model thing, I guarantee you, you will go home. OK. Up next, Amanda. Is this Anna or Mia? Okay, Anna. That's a great shot. I like it a lot. She's just captured the mood of what she's been asked to do. The face is great, too. It gives okay, she kind of a little bit concerned about the weight. This was the only shot that worked. And it's interesting because she between you and your sister, this well, is your true, true dream. I know that you want she this, and I think that you probably have more ability than some a, of the other girls you know behind what? you. She did a, she but did I a feel good like job. you got Let's nervous. Just, Were you nervous? She did a good job. Yeah, everyone was watching mine. So you know what you have to do when everybody's watching you? Turn it into a performance. Good. Job well You're done. You're watching me. Let me job show you well how done. amazing I am. There are always extra yeah. bodies. It's not just you and the photographer. Mm -hmm. All righty, up next is Michelle. So, Michelle, you had a photo shoot, mm -hmm. and yours was, I think, the most controversial in the bunch. Mm -hmm. Oh. oh. <laughs> These are good shots. It's a scary shot. That. But yeah. th that means you got it. You really went for it. This is what this whole exercise was about, putting that acting <laughs> into it, too. You got an emotion out of it. All right, thank you. Next is Melrose. So, Melrose, you actually were the challenge winner. So, congratulations yes. to that. Yeah, she didn't deserve to win. All right, she Melrose, sucked. you think the blazer makes you look challenge. like, I used to model, and I'm oh. going to show you how to pose today. Blazer off. Oh. Also, put your hair in a ponytail. Oh, look stuff. at that. Oh, what a difference. I swear, Melrose, you've shaved off eight years. All right, so Melrose, you had she a photo shoot. She is ancient. She's 23. Pretty much a grandma. You perhaps could show a little bit more emotion. What worries me in a shot like this is that you photograph looking old. And, you know, that's with retouching. Jason. She is old. You're very argumentative. She's 23. You were late for the shoot and we were the worst of the day. Melrose, everybody knows how much Disgusting I hate girls who are late lady. to my sets. Janasha. Big problem right now is that you're a little late, which is never a good thing. Like, I apologize honestly. and it won't happen again. Up next That's is Brooke. That's retouching. OK, Brooke A. So Brooke was the jealous girl <laughs> throwing the other blonde down the Brooke stairs. Brooke A, OK. You have such a pretty, delicate face. Mm -hmm. And in this shot, I've lost well, that. Well, she has a lot of Brooke, jaw. in your film, you were very similar to Monique, thinking that anger is <sighs> You know, you have to figure out how to make an ugly, pretty face. Basically, you need to practice. One thing we don't have a is a lot of time. Like a dream Thank you guys. Yeah. All right, up next to Shagina. I don't remember where her... Oh. It looks great. I think it's a great shot. For me, because you've got a great face, and that didn't come across in that photograph to me. It just kind of went into blandness for me. I was so frustrated with you because, to me, you're one of the okay. strongest faces here. So to see you just well, kind of sitting on it, it's like, Well, you guys set her up like, with that fucking on. category. All right, up next is AJ. <laughs> Like, I usually can, when a girl comes up, I can, like, feel their desire. And with you, I don't feel that. Why do you think I'm feeling that? Low confidence. I don't look like the other girls. I have a different thing going on. So tens of thousands of girls tried out for it. I you mean, managed still, to make it down to the final few. Bit. I don't know. Like, for some reason, you know what? Yeah. insecurity. <laughs> Period. Your model stereotype was on the casting couch. <laughs> look at that face. 
Do you think that's a pretty face or not? It's okay. Well, I've got news for you. I think that's one of the best faces I've seen so far in any of the pictures. <laughs> trying to find your neck hidden behind that collar. Yeah, they kept, they kept pushing it up, and I feel like you're very full of excuses. It is not the collar. Look, I'm going to show you an example. And it's covering my neck. But look at me. You see my energy? It's covering my neck still. But do you feel the difference? Yeah, I do. <laughs> Girl, All right, AJ. No. Thanks, guys. <laughs> up next Girl, is what? Christian. <laughs> How's everybody? No, All right, Christian. It. What's going on with your hair? It's not model. Yeah. I was just trying not to pull my hair back so much because it's getting damaged. That's yeah. just weird that you would make that decision, like when this is the place where you need to wear it the right way and risk some split ends. Uh, models are a little more sort of uh -oh. worn at the edges. Touch <laughs> my hair. You know what? We're going to work you out. We're going to dress you up. And it's much better. Thank you. <laughs> I look so much better. Shit. The photo just doesn't work for me. You look what? so much she better in the good. flesh. So I wasn't sure if I was grasping the concept too well. If they say be a bad actress, go for it and be a bad actress. <gasps> so <gasps> you know, bad the for it. And Jay said they got frustrated because you kept doing Swiggy the same shot so over aggy. and over again. Swiggy and it looked like you were right. catching flies with your mouth. <laughs> Last but not least is Jada. This outfit. The chili in here? <laughs> So I should take this off? Is that a hint? <laughs> You're looking like the suburban mom right now. <laughs> this is high school and mall. We don't do that. Period, in fashion. Tyra. No, no. I'm on your side with this one. Essentially, we want to see you. We don't want you to be hidden behind all that clothes. <laughs> Ta da! Beautiful. I think you have to work on looking, on, just, on bringing out your femininity. Jada, and going through your like film, a low budget I gotta photo tell shoot, you, but everything it looks good. looked like this. Probably would have thrown a little more facial expression there, even though like, I thought I was in pain. Thanks. All right, so now mm. it is time for the judges to deliberate. The face wasn't fair. And when I call you back, right. I'm going to announce which one of you will be eliminated. Oh, my God. I honestly don't know things. <laughs> It's time to decide who's going to go home. AJ. I was very, very excited about AJ when I saw her. Okay, I skip do the like critique. her photographs. At casting, I didn't know she, she didn't skip the have confidence. She has no self confidence. It's going to be very bad for her. Jada. Like this is a not a great angle for her. Just Jada kind of has a very masculine look. She does give you a very drag. Because we all know, as people of color, you can be taught that that's not beautiful. And for her to look at herself into tear up and, and to see dark eyes and think that's beautiful, she's already winning in this competition. Christian. She's got beautiful eyes. <laughs> she's got lovely skin tone. I just think she's quite boring. You took the words out of my mouth. <laughs> Brooke. Her personality outside of this photo is it's, it's, it's great. It's not here. Not just is it mediocre, it's actually a little ugly. Megan. I don't like this photograph very much, but I like her. She's a bit like Okay, Kim. they set her Kim. up. It's kind of that androgynous. She had thing other good photos. Well, yes, I cheers. know they set Carrie her D. up. Triddly D, Triddly D, Carrie D. Like, she Carrie had D better photos. one of the easiest photos. I mean, she got dumb blonde. And I think dumb blonde is resting on easy for Carrie D. Monique. I love Monique. Her weakness may be being afraid to be ugly. Well, she did a bunch of shots like this. <sighs> Great body. I do think she's got something, and she's very interesting and very beautiful. Melrose. She does look a little bit long in the tooth. I think we can bust her up and try to make her look a little young and fresh. I think it's just cleaning her face. I'm just so disappointed in her performance on the set and to be talking back to Mr. J and flipping out and blaming this and blaming that. It's like, she didn't this is talk the first week. back. When you did can she be cut talk like back? That. She didn't you talk bitch. back. Hide it. <laughs> <laughs> she's a cranky old lady. She's only 23. She's ancient. He asked her a question and she answered. Thirteen beautiful young ladies stand before me, but I only have twelve photos in my hands. You guys are And sexist. these photos represent the twelve of you that will still be in the running towards becoming the America's next safe. top model. The first name that I'm going to call... Oh my God. Michelle. Yeah, the twins are safe. Congratulations. He's still in the running towards becoming America's Next Top Model. Honestly. The next name that I'm going to call... Carrie D. Oh. I don't even remember who Carrie... Like, I already forgot what she did. AJ. She was the casting couch? Megan. Okay, good. I, I, I actually Until like Plane Crash. Okay, period. I, I like her, too. The next name that I am going to call... Meg? She was right? a druggie. <laughs> Congratulations. 
Thank you. The next name that I'm going to call is Monique. Okay, period. I like Monique. Melrose is so mad, period. It's getting scared. She didn't deserve it. Oh my god, Melrose. The next name that I'm going Brooke to call. Brooke is so safe. Brooke is so safe. Brooke. Yeah, Brooke is safe. I, don't know, I think Melrose is done week. for. Congratulations. Honestly, I think Melrose might be done for. Because the other girl was a little boring, but... Oh, Melrose and Christian, please step forward. Christian, she she didn't do bad. I only have one photo in my hands. Like, I feel like Melrose is done for. And I will only call one name. The girl that I do not call must immediately return to the house, pack her belongings. Christian, you walked into this room and didn't look like a model. The judges also looked at your photo and said, like, there's something that's bad, just though. not popping through. Two of the judges even said she's boring. Melrose, your photo, you, have tell, why you tell have one of the most notorious And by the way, two just think you're boring. And we look at that photo and we like, we're like, she had all that to go on <laughs> and she delivered that. And then on top of that, the attitude that she had on the set is just not acceptable. I'm sorry, Melrose. It's just over. I'm so sorry. It's a little too late, sorry, to Melrose. Go on. I have one photo <laughs> in my hands. I think Christian's safe. And if we catch you being a diva in your next photo shoot, you're going oh, oh home. That is so rigged. Melrose did worse. Like, honestly, Melrose did so much worse. And you're going to have to be waking up for a lot less than $10,000 a day for a long time. I'll work for like a dollar. Okay. Congratulations. Thank you. It's because she won the mini challenge. I mean, I didn't love Christian, but I feel like she didn't do the worst by far. Like, she did not do the worst. So. One more? One more or done? I'm crushed. I am tired. I'm not going to act like I didn't want it because I did. And I'm just really mad at myself. I mean, I'm not going to quit, one but okay, this just hurts really bad right now. I was hoping they really could. I do need a snack, though. Like, I do need, I do need to get I really a feel like I, I could have go wireless headphones. Competition. I have wireless I think I want headphones. more than anybody in there. I'll be able to hear. And I really didn't see it coming. Okay, is it gonna play the next one on its own? Oh. Okay. I suck so bad. Really no, but you still look good. I'm getting a snack, but I can today. still hear. I love Megan. Like, she's just such a great, like, personality. So I've gotten really close to her. We were practicing our, um, runway walk together. We we're competing against each other. You know, but that's the way it should be. It should be, like, help each other, you know? Get each other to the top. I'm happy to be here. And I've been thinking a lot about Christian today. Just how much she must be going through and that I could be there. If we catch you being a diva in your next photo shoot, you're oh, going Oh, my God! Home. I'm happy that they saw potential in me, and I'm gonna work my ass off. Melrose, that was such an act. Come on, I'm sorry. <laughs> you see her squeezing out tears. Mm. She's a fake. That's yeah. the person I can't stand the most in this house. Oh, no! Read it! Every morning, I have to have two glasses of fresh squeezed OJ to get me going. This morning, I suggest you do the same. OJ! OJ! Oh, oh, This alarm clock, it's like four or five of them that's gone off. And I'm still trying to sleep, okay? I'm still trying to get my beauty sleep, okay? So I ended up waking up on a very, very bad side this morning. Monique just has this attitude. She just looks at you, she's like, like you're despicable, get away from me. Can't stand the bitchiness. Eat breakfast and break some bread and chit chat. We thought we were gonna get a makeover. You all want makeovers? Yeah. 
Yeah. You always, everybody always talks about makeup and liking them, and then when you get them, you'll bust out crying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't care. I got hair. Please. So I want to talk to you girls about drawing on your experiences to motivate your modeling. For example, Megan, when you were speaking during casting, mm -hmm. the first thing I said was, I love your strength of character. When I was nine, I was in a plane crash. My mother eventually died in the airplane. I feel like I've always been an optimistic person, just who I am. I will survive. Like, I'm totally gonna, you know, it's just like, you won't let yourself go. Let me tell you, if you guys want to be successful models, going to a place of vulnerability is one of the most difficult things to do. But if you can do it, it will really come through in your photos. Oh, it was great having breakfast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll see you soon. with stations and mirrors and everything. This used to be your living room. But now it has turned into Can the Frederick fucking Fakai yelling? Salon. Frederick Fakai is a legend in the fashion industry. I mean, he has done my hair since I was 17 years One, two, old three, working on runway heard with So everyone today is going to leave One, two, three, looking like a top that. model like they are. of the America's Next Top Model Association. So you need to be edged out. Oh, no. I'm you. you are getting a chocolate brown. Oh, Miss Eugenia, oh, you think you're better than everybody else? You know, like, the last yeah, season of America's is. Next she Top Model Girls. They're boring. It just seems like they're really generic. And a she's girl a that thinks she's better than everybody else needs some hair, girl. Oh, Miss Megan, oh, the pixie needs to be taken to the next Oh, oh. You're getting layers and some shortening. I need layers. I've had this for years and years. Yeah. Your forehead She's gonna right now is really, really low. So we actually have threaders back there. Your right now gonna move back your it's really, really low. So you're going to go from an actual forehead to a Tyra Banks five head, girl. Oh, All right, no. Monique. Do what do like we do to this girl that already looks great? There's a picture of me a long time ago. I was laying on the sand in Jamaica. And we use that picture as inspiration for Monique's hair. Okay. I want more, you know? I kind of wanted a little bit different. Like, maybe cut my hair or something or, like, dye it a different color. Miss Carrie D, when your hair is like this, you tend to look a little too actressy. So can you let your hair down for Frederick? He's going to help. Let the master take control. Oh, you want weed? Oh, holla. <laughs> AJ. Yay, we weed. Have the channel, Linda Evangelista, circa 1992, baby. We're going to lighten it up a bit. Linda and Mangelista? Sometimes it's about embracing what God gave you. So we know you have a little frizzy curl, and you're going to get more of it today. Oh, wow. Michelle, you're a little mousy. So we have to throw away the mouse and bring the fire, baby. Amanda, we're taking you. Fire engine. You're gonna have texture, Michelle and Amanda. You're gonna be straight and classy like you are. Oh and last but not least, Miss Jada. Yeah, yeah, that's One thing that you it. said is, I'm the prettiest girl in school. You know, everybody says how pretty I am, but actually in this competition, you're actually the most handsome. Now that might sound like an insult, but what we're saying is it's kind of a boyish quality to your face, and that photograph is really strong. So to embrace I think Terry's that, little kernels of poop in my actress. cereal, but the bowl's empty. Nova so no words. Oh my god. You called Thank it you, Helio. You said you can Welcome cut my back. hair off. I don't friend. care. Your modeling will have to change with this. You have to go totally against what you have been raised to be. Okay? And all of you are going to get these absolutely glorious looks. 
and you're gonna be modeling in a sexy photo shoot in metallic swimsuits. Are we ready? They really said to her, you're not the prettiest, you're the most handsome. <laughs> I mean, you know it's gonna look good. I'm scared, I'm like scared I'm not gonna be able to pull it off. Oh my god. Oh my god. I knew they were saving me for last for a reason. I don't want to look the same. Shut my hair off. Have they ever done like shape balls? Rocks. Have they ever made the girls like shape signature it all hair lady? Off, like, to I can do more head banging in this hair than yes. I can do Oh, she hurt. is. Yeah. She's like, nope. Huh. Okay, that yeah, that was the Mariah Carey. The threading part, <laughs> it hurt like a bitch, but yeah. instead of being two heads, I'm like a three, four head. I feel great. No effect for you, look the same. Flat. Why? Because I just feel like my hair pops out with, with dark features. And we try and figure it out, and I think you'll look younger. I think you'll look a little fresher. I can't believe Mount Rose is all upset. They, they, they yeah. literally keep calling her Honestly, old over position, and over again. I wouldn't want to be blonde either. What happened to Meg Ryan? <laughs> Meg Ryan's gone home. That looks so good. Thank you. It's sexy. I've never had brown hair. I've always been a blondie. <laughs> But Frederick Sakai is the master. No, brown hair is beautiful. Brooke. Brown Honestly, hair is I don't know if I can work with this new hair. I'm just really bad with hair in general. Pretty much anything girly I'm bad at. Me and my sister were kind of disappointed about having different looks because now we can't switch. Oh, so what? We can't trick people as easily. Oh, God. But what are you going to try? No, you Wait not. a minute, but she's cutting this part the back The twins' here. hair color oh, looks like this. shit. Ah! This is fun. Calm down. Whatever. I just feel so masculine. I feel like I lost it my like, looks girlish so bad. Oh my god, it looks horrible. I looked in the mirror after they got done styling <laughs> it, it and everything. It just felt so beautiful bitch, on the outside. What? I feel beautiful on the inside. It's kind of all like matched it up. How ratty is that fucking thing? I thought they were going to chop it off and shave me down and all that <laughs> stuff, but I was pleased with my makeup. Okay, yeah, she so looks good. Shots. I don't want to miss them. She looks good. Oh my god, your eyes are so popping out now. It was amazing having Frederick Fakai work on us. He cut my hair in like two minutes. And I was like, wow, oh, it looks perfect. Nice. Okay, that looks good on her. <laughs> that looks horrible. I don't know why they did that to her. Melrose really is just a control freak. A lot of young girls that try to over control the situation, they don't go too far. Her eyebrows, she looks crazy. You look so this is my look. Yes, it looks crazy. Can they tone that shit? What the fuck is wrong with this guy? We have to make it darker. What do we do? No, I hate this color. Please. When I first got my hairstyle, I was in shock. It's still a little bit too light for my liking, and I'm not a smooth girl. I like spikes. I forgot what she looked like before. Oh, it looks the same. Jay, oh, Miss Moni. Look, look at her. 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 I can't even sleep because it's like the alarm's going off and I can't sleep. Do you want this career? This is not hard. You are getting a fresh hair weave by a master stylist. And We're if the alarm's going off, weave. put in earplugs. To see these young girls who, who supposedly wanted to be here so badly, just kind of throw it off and say, ugh, I don't like it. It just disgusts she me. Good. And it makes me not want to be here. Guys, when you really walk into good. this business, you walk into this business as blank canvases. I wish that when I was 18 or 19, I had people come in and take me to the next level. So you I hate your hair, and, and you're actually being insulting in front of a master who's been in this business. No, you were. Just listen for one second. Miss Thing's crying up there because she got her tracks out, and this and that. And it's like, <sighs> you're insulting our guests. You're insulting Tyra inevitably. I'm like over it. I'm just okay, gonna go but it's sleep. their hair. Like if they don't like it, they don't like it. Although I think Monique does look really good. I look like a stranger. 
The hair I'm master did not do that. Good. Hair, I mean, he toned this point. bitch's hair, but Melrose's hair is literally yeah. orange. Yeah, like, the twins so like, and, have the know. same hair oh, color. Really? They didn't like it? Like, they, they look more similar than they did before. Oh, she's lesbian. Oh, my God. He's so correct. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm a little angry today. Dude, I love my hair. It looks so hot with every outfit. Girl, you look fucking stupid. Girl queens are natural beauties that don't need makeup to make it to the top. Dot, dot, dot. So don't wear any today. Got it? Yeah. Plane crash is actually lesbian. Good morning. It was a really long day yesterday. There were a lot of tears. Today you get an opportunity to make that up to me. I want you girls to try and impress me with your knowledge of makeup. I've got the whole CoverGirl collection here with me today. That girl and the new so Queen collection, stupid. which was developed for women of color by Queen Latifah. CoverGirl is all inclusive, and there is something for everybody behind me. So your challenge today is I'm gonna give you girls 30 seconds to grab girl, the makeup the that Shakira best suits you behind me, and, me, and then you're gonna so meet me in the elevator. Dumb. And along the way, we're gonna stop on different floors. They One floor, you're gonna find wardrobe. On another floor, you're gonna find shoes and accessories. During that time, you're gonna put together your own new young queen look. When we get to the top floor, you're gonna have your opportunity to meet with a CoverGirl executive, and you're gonna have to sell them on your look. If you miss the elevator doors, you're instantly disqualified. Oh, wow. They don't have any stamina. They all have no They have no energy. Seconds, girls. <laughs> We're going up. You know what, guys? You guys got clothes. You got 30 seconds, all right? 30 seconds. Last clothes. Last clothes. Oh my god, they're wearing skin. Over here. Ten seconds. Oh my god, they're all gonna be on you, not carrying them. Monique! When Monique doesn't make the elevator, everyone is like, oh, we're all getting beaten up tonight in the house for hey. sure. Get off the elevator. Thank you, Katie Perry. The girls are going to room 3108, where you're going to meet name your cover girl executive. I remember you. Thank you. Oh, my God. What's up, girls? I'm here representing cover girl and the queen collection. <laughs> had to do your own makeup today. But, you know, when you get to ball status like, like me, you get to hire me. a makeup artist. So I don't like her because she had beef Santa with Floyd, me. who is my makeup artist, is here. Hi. Don't they look great? They're beautiful. They are. All right. What I like to do is talk to each one of you about what a young queen look is to you. So what'd you go for? The queen should be beautiful without makeup and with. I think it was bronze, oh but it's great. I'm not sure she what exactly I put on. It doesn't matter. You come in here and just act like, hey, this is what I am, this is what it is, and I think that confidence will go a long way for you. I tried to just highlight my eyes with just mascara. Great vibe, bad shoes. That's it. Uh, damn it. Damn no shoes. <laughs> Today I was going for the queen of beach. Cameron D said we gonna take up to the beach rocks. Yeah. Feeling like we in the beach in the 60s, though. I thought that a cover girl queen should be fresh, confident, and regal. I think you nailed it with the wardrobe. Yeah. We just wish you would have used a little more of the product. What I did was kind of a color splash because being a woman of color, we have a problem wearing colorful eyeshadow. So I just wanted to take advantage of the fact that you guys provided colors for us. And I thought you looked great. I'm still in high school, so the first thing I thought <laughs> when I thought queen was 
prom queen. The prom queen. Okay, prom. We wanted to know what a young queen was to you, and we thought you did a great, great job. job having an idea what that was. <laughs> I went for the more natural look. Uh, I used the soft sable loose color to shine up my face. You're beautiful. You're oh, gorgeous. Stunning. Stunning. It's really stunning. Let your personality out for us to share with you. I was going for the type of style she where you go out to the high school, movie, oh especially with my wild uh, uh, hair. Mm -hmm. and have gorgeous Absolutely. lips. Which Someone needs to lock to Tyra. See more of our color. Thank you. Yeah. I just uh, use CoverGirl True Blend to hide all those blemishes because nobody's perfect. You seem to have a really good awareness of the product. I thought I one of really the twins natural. was going to be brunette. Um, a little bit of color up here on the eye ginger. and then the Why blush and the simple ginger? lip. That really is going to go a long way for you, and it definitely went a long way for you in this room. You guys they should give yourselves a round shit. of applause. You had no time to do an amazing job, and I think you all pulled it off. Right. But the person that we chose as the winner is Eugenia. You she actually did eat. use the color the best. She did. <laughs> now, what we need you to do is choose two people. Ooh. Carrie and Jada. Hey. You will be taking a photo shoot tomorrow, which will be featured on the CoverGirl website. Congratulations. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. She picked the girl Thank with the you. fuck ass hair to be on CoverGirl. <laughs> oh, I know Tyra. This is my so. Queen Latifah. Yeah. I shook her hand and everything. Monique seemed pretty pissed, so I think I'm going to avoid her for like the rest of the day. Tonight, I really need to get on the phone with my landlord. I need to talk to her about potentially getting my deposit back. I'm gonna lose a thousand dollars. Yeah, me too. The bitch is broke. I don't know. Yeah, nothing. I mean, this is where I get of getting back at this for her getting cute. These little raggedy, non-talented models. Please. I ain't never even thought about being a model until they walked into the audition and also they want to come in here and act like they the stuff. What? Right, girl, you spelled. We were trying to get her attention, so um, everybody's like th thinking of funny ways, you know, to piss her off, like she's joking around. <laughs> There's one way to do it. Oh, wait, oh, wait, oh, wait. <laughs> I'm just enjoying this phone call. It's great. We're having... I'm really enjoying my phone conversation. Who does that? Monique Who really is do that? Well It's not our fault. You couldn't get in the damn elevator. Don't take it out on us. Why doesn't Melrose just knock and say, hey, I really need to talk to my landlord about my deposit. Would you mind giving me 10 minutes on the phone? She's a drama queen. She's just a stupid little bitch. Get off. Do not hang up my phone. Do not hang up my phone. Do not touch the phone. I'm on the phone. You do not have the right to come in here and hang up. It's an hour. You need to go talk to somebody else. Don't you ever come and touch the phone. You need to quit. I'm not getting off the phone. If you like to make okay, call, three out. Uh, I don't know if I can defend her. You guys will all kiss my grits as far as I care. Oh, I'm sorry. I spent so long on the phone. Sorry you guys need the phone. Oh, my God. Is it time for me? Oh. Everyone needs to stop responding to her. Seriously. Eventually, she will be so fed up with being the most hated girl in this house. And Why is Sony so annoying? They keep disrespecting like, me, but I might end up busting out and never seeing like that again. You know. She's acting like a spoiled little brat. It's time to wake up. I got ugly up Betty. The get the get fuck down. away. Like, like you look, you're, you're gonna buy Twitch stuff. Like you look fucking disgusting. Stop. Good morning, America. Now let's talk a little bit about yesterday. Eugenia, you met with Miss Queen Latifah and you most embodied the new young queen look, right? <laughs> Who are your two friends? Jada and Carrie. Are they so still the three here? of you girls and get to do a photo shoot? And where's Monroe Charming? Girls first. This is really your first taste of cover girl. They love... Make it work for you. I think the girls might be a little bit jealous, I'm but... I'm with What do you Tomorrow, do? I'm going to no chat. Chat's going to be email only the whole stream. Okay, you three, go ahead and get changed and meet us back out front. Look at her fucking hair. It is all we have uneven. Never it looks had like she cut it herself and couldn't This much the fun on a photo shoot. We have flown hair in master three my very special people to do some of the most crazy, outrageous hair. Hair shows like Hair Wars feature giant, crazy wigs that often have moving parts. These street styles have crossed over to the runways, and today you're going to have to rock this style. Oh, 
Wow. The theme of today is, does the hair wear you, or do you wear the hair? <laughs> Let me introduce you to your team. Bam. <laughs> I'm Mr. Little. Hey. Hey. I'm Lisa B. Hey. I'm Weaving Steven. <laughs> you guys ready to get working? Yeah. Yeah. I'm ready. Yeah, you're ready. Got like a suitcase full of hair. Can't do this with your everyday client. They'll say, Don't give me one of those crazy oh, hairdos. <laughs> <laughs> this challenge is like layers be in the front, and then give me a little soup. And then I have like the trophy on my head because I'm a winner. You okay, come through all about your makeup. Can you sell me you and not this? <laughs> it does a nice little glisten on your eyes, just for a little hint in beauty. Makes them not quite so dry looking. Watching me and Why I was is like, everyone you know in what? the industry Boop so shady? All you guys, you know, look at me and I was just enjoying my shoot. Yo, Monique, I'm gonna be honest with you. This is pretty good. Oh. They're not gonna eliminate Monique now because she Nacho, worked the draw. I need a spot. I love your body language. Everything is working okay, in your favor. Eat egg. Eat egg. Ah! Hey, Brooke, we need something crazy this is so or zany. Lana. Like that you stepped out of yourself Brooke's to do kind of something mother. that wasn't safe. Find me anything about so this. Can I use this? Me She's kind of mother. Yeah, sure. Amanda, you've got great features. You should use them to your advantage. Really work that neck for me. It's a bird hawk. It's not a mohawk. It's a bird hawk. I looked actually really cool, but it was really funny at the same time. I seriously resemble two cantans. Really good, Michelle. You look fucking dumb. Activate the spinners. <laughs> Shoulder down. Okay, they said Megan. And they said Megan. Megan, what are you thinking? I'm trying to think of emotions. Like you're trying to think of emotions, they or do you have any emotions? Oh we talked God. about this at breakfast the other day. Being in a place where we're vulnerable. I didn't realize how hard metaphor, it was to show emotion like in your crash. face, but you really do it's have to put yourself back it. to a certain time where you felt a certain way. I would like to see Meg. Give me something I don't like that's a Mac. little more quirky. I don't like Mac. Oh, I'm going to be cool. honest. I don't like Mac. Oh, She's right. just not my girl. Drop the hand down. The hand can ruin the Meg shot. is the Give one who was like a rocker girl. This isn't fun. She did like the drug photo shoot. Eugenia, the last Eugenia. she had the attitude of, I know exactly what I'm doing, and she knew nothing. Carrie D. Give me some fire, girl. I don't remember Beautiful, girl. Your shots are so powerful. Ugh, I'm, I'm really happy. But she looks fucking good. Work it, girl. Work it. Here you be looking fucking good. Let's go. Ooh, I like this one. Look at this. Honestly, I don't know if rude, but I don't think Melrose has a pretty enough face to be a model. Like, she's definitely the ugliest girl there. Like, her face looks like all kinds of I just like really tried to focus on what the photographer was doing. And I ended up getting like angry, and I think I show that in my picture. All I've got for about 40 frames is woman in the green wig. She I think you she go looks home? good. No. Give me something else. You got four shots to do it. I don't know what to do now. That's it. I didn't see it changing those four frames. Oh my she looks God. good to me. Like she's giving faith. What else is she gonna do? Tomorrow you'll really meet with the judges. Have a crazy Only 11 will continue on in hopes of becoming too much. America's next top model. Love, Tara. Amanda was reading a Tara mail, and before I knew it, Melrose just went crazy. Ah! Ah! I'm gonna vomit. Monique puts her hand up her wet towel and it like goes like that onto my face. <laughs> None of us want to see anybody go home except money because she's crazy and we're like, can't live with her. Like, she's impossible to live with. She threw her dishwasher at her? <laughs> oh. Okay, Ben Franklin. Her reveals suck. Like, honestly, what is this grandma trick? I don't recognize any of you. Like, you her all reveals look are not amazing. Given. You know about our fabulous prizes. Honestly. First is a modeling contract with Elite Model Management, which is one of the top model agencies in the world. A cover of Seventeen magazine and 
a six-page fashion editorial spread in Seventeen as well. And we all know about that CoverGirl contract worth $100,000. And of course, you know our judges. The first is Mr. Nigel Barker, noted fabulous fashion photographer. Miss J. Alexander, runway diva, teacher, extraordinaire. Okay, J. Alexander is like the queen icon. of the show. Hello. Can we talk about it? And Miss Tracy Bain, the photographer that shot you all this week. And you like, have been around Top Model for a while now. The first photo shoot you did was the horoscope Always. photo shoot, which was absolutely gorgeous. And you did the girls falling as princesses. Now it's time for your individual evaluations, and after that, the judges will deliberate, and we will discuss which one of you lovely honestly, girls is going know. home this week. I so hope Nola they don't send first. home the girl they said was masculine. I love because you, she blonde. Off all her hair for I never knew how big your lips were. The makeover is sort of just opens you up. You look fresh, young. So Melrose, you had She's a photo shoot pretty. with some very wacky hair, seeing, no with the people that do the hair wars and the hood her hair girl. Needs to be As a model, you have to break through and shine, her even if there's so many huge. other crazy things going on. She looks so let's mad. see how you did. I love the body movement in this photo. It's, it's, it's genius. That's an ugly, weird, strange pose that you're doing, but you're like, okay, I'm going for it. All right, Melrose, thank you. Thank you. Up like, next her hair is needs Hachi. to be toned so bad. <gasps> the hair mask. Gone is Rapunzel, and instead we have modern young ladies. Here's your best she shot. looks good. That's beautiful. I mean, that could be out of vogue, that shot. You look amazing. Is that a windmill in your hair? Is that actually <laughs> moving? It's moving. Every single girl's hair was moving. She, but one thing, she you have such hair. tiny features. You need to over-exaggerate them. Because that was just one shot in your film. I wanted to see, like, ten of those. Thank you very much. Up next is Jada. She wow. Look at you. I don't feel like you're owning it. I feel like you're scared of that hair. I'm still a little awkward, but it's getting better. I don't want to see that. I don't want to feel that, because I'm like, I gave her something so dramatic, she can't handle it. Maybe she should just go home and just count the days until her hair grows back. Here is your Okay, Tyra, shot. let's You've got to make it look a little bit more relaxed. It's almost an aggressive picture. You come here, and there's girls that are just as pretty, if not prettier, than you are. Tyra You're has no longer the prettiest girl in school, her. and I feel like it's getting to you. I just have to get used to it. All right, Jada, thank you. Up next, Meg. Look at you, Meg. <laughs> I love your hair. I was thinking, who's that? That's somebody new. You look so different. Thank you. you. So, Meg, you had a photo dumb. shoot. Let's see how you did. You have to work with that underbite, because in this picture, it's coming through a little bit. The minute you relax, you just turn into, like, a normal girl. So you got to pull that model out. Next is <laughs> Carrie D. So you're yeah. a little wet today. Is Whoa, that wet? Whoa, the like, the clean palette, the tying it back, showing us your features. Yeah. This isn't it. Carrie D, you had a photo shoot. That's the egg. <laughs> you managed to oh, get that though. jot without losing your neck. She which is very, very good. You she look a little mannish normal. in this picture. You have to be careful. You've got that strong jawbone, which can make you look a little drag. I don't think she does that at all. Oh, she looks fucking good. <laughs> Up next is Eugenia. So let's see this hair, Eugenia. Pull it forward. OK. Gorgeous. Here's your she best looks shot. Amazing. Ooh. You just I look too like masculine that, in that photograph for me. And I like androgynous, but that looks manly. You're probably wondering, why was that picture chosen? It was the only picture that you gave anything. It was like you were asleep with your eyes open on this shoot. I gave you so much direction, but the look in your face is, <laughs> oh, I already know that. You even verbally said that you think that you're better than the other girls in the past seasons of Top Model. You need to rewind. I rewound. You need some humble pie. But the one good thing is you won the challenge this How week. How can, like, you look masculine? Girls the best put together they gave them right, the outfits. You. Did their makeup Shop. and put on their hair. If it it's now, it looks if that's what it's giving, oh, that's what y'all go. I was impressed. Like, what do they mean? Film, that little kiss of the shoulder, that is hot. Again, she looks lots a fucking of shots mess. to choose from. <laughs> that's a good problem to have. All right, Michelle, thank you. Up next is your sister, Amanda. Another ginger girl. That looks beautiful on you. Can we see it behind your ears, though? Actually, your ears are big, but that's pretty. That's like makes you you and like original, and, and I love the big ear. So let's see your best shot. Wow. Mm. You came out and said, you know what? Okay, I she looks good. In. This is the side that she looks best good. at. Yeah, and you found I it. I like that. All right, up next is Brooke. Pretty. Whoa. The luscious brunette. Brooke is kind of mothering. Your eyes like pop. I love it. You Brooke had a photo shoot mothering. where you had to do some very big patriotic hair. Yes, ma'am. Well, let's see how you did. Shamba country, <laughs> she's a V. It's just a great <laughs> shot oh, of you. When I look at you in person, I worry that perhaps you're too cutesy. But the fact that you can deliver a shot like this gives me faith. I mean, it's Thank just you guys. horrible. Megan, <laughs> let's know. see if you were able to pop out from all that craziness. Looking at that photograph, it, it looks like something from a funny 50s ladies magazine. She's over. I'm not happy. I need more neck. This is not a great picture. In fact, this is probably the weakest shot we've seen out of the bunch. She doesn't even have a lot of hair from what I can see. Mm -hmm. no. You got lost. 
And that's what this photo shoot was about, is about not getting lost I for all of that, because there's a lot going on. All right, up next her is AJ. Her mom froze to death Look on at you. Oh, my goodness. It takes away that kind of gothy thing as well. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Very peculiar. You have to be careful that when a photographer is low, they're getting amazing angles. That's why your body and everything looks great, because her camera's lower than you are. It's down here. But your nose got a little big. All right, AJ. Good. Thank you. Your nose got a little All right, big. last but not least is Monique. <laughs> I love the picture because it's such a great oh, graphic shot, but angry. I don't actually like you in it. The face is like a mobile phone without a signal. Blank. She looks Mr. J said that you had a huge improvement from um, your about? first shoot. First shoot was so bad, you had nowhere to go but up. Thank you very much. She looks good. All right, when I call nice. you back, I will announce which one of you will be eliminated. OK, but seriously, the theme was All right, horrible. so who's going like, home? We've got to decide right now. This was not fair. Start with Michelle. I think Michelle is one of the strong ones. Her leaning to okay, her left like step. that looks like she really knows what she's doing. Amanda. Man. Look about her with that curly hair coming down. For Monique to deliver this as a picture just screams, I don't Monique know what I'm doing. Looks good. She looks quite drag, and I think that's an mm -hmm. issue that she has to deal with. She I love her looking like a drag queen in this picture, though. I've noticed. It's, it's a good bad. thing. We reach a decision. Let's go. She does not look drag. Like, I'm sorry. Oh, no, my lesbian queen better not go home. Twelve oh young girls stand before me, but I only have <laughs> 11 photos me. in my hands. I and like these photos really represent the 11 of you that will still be in the running towards right? becoming America's next top model. The first name that I'm going to call, Melrose. I just don't see it. She's literally so ugly. Last week, your picture was dreadful. Like, but this ew. picture looks like a model she that like would only wake station. up for ten thousand dollars a day. Congratulations! Just, I'm not it. You're still only running towards becoming America's next top model. Macho, congratulations! She's queen. That's my Michelle. I like the twins. Congratulations! I like the twins. AJ. Carrie D. Oof. Gina. Oh my god, please Gina. play Crash. Just get rid of Monique. Meg. Oh, Congratulations. You're still in the running towards becoming America's next top model. <laughs> please play. Keep the going next strong. Name that I will call. Monique. What? Congratulations. Oh, You're still in the running no, towards becoming America's girl. next top model. I thought Monique was going to be death Will Jada and Megan please step forward? OK, you know what? We I have, only have, we have one photo in my hands. The and girl who got her hair cut short was not giving energy America's during the coming out either. I'll call I feel like Jada's done. Name. And the girl that I do not call must immediately return to your house, pack your belongings, and go. Oh, my god. It's interesting, you both standing before me, because Megan and Jada, you guys have short haircuts. And to the eye, you both look so strong. But you two failed the challenge of the photo shoot this week miserably. We lost both of you behind all that hair in the photo shoot. But maybe one of you can be found. Jada. Look at that. Who is that? What is that? You need to go home and throw a mop over your head. <laughs> and see if you can model through that. That is your challenge. This is so Congratulations. Heartbreaking. You're still in the running towards becoming America's next top model. You know what? I'm a little bit glad that she stayed because they did cut off all of her hair. And they have been calling her a man drag queen the whole show. Mm. But I liked Megan more. Okay. Playing Crash was out serving. Hi, guys. It's sad, you know, saying goodbye. I am surprised that, like, I went this early because I thought it was going to last longer than that. But in modeling, you're not given very many opportunities. I wish I was more myself. Honestly, up there her faces the were never and, giving in the picture. Know, maybe I could have shown a little more character. So maybe it was her, just her time. Because if we're being really <laughs> real, her pictures were not giving. Her mom did not die for this. Okay, she literally came out and she was like, Tyra was like, there was a tragedy that happened to you recently, right? And she was like, when I was nine, I was in a plane crash. Bitch, it was like 14 years ago. Get the fuck over it. Like, seriously, it wasn't even recent. <laughs> like, her mom didn't even know she wanted to be a model at that point. Like, she had no idea. <laughs> like...
<laughs> One more, please. Guys, I go to bed so early, like, I can't. I can't. We'll watch more tomorrow. Tomorrow we'll watch more. I'll bookmark this. How many episodes is it? Um... Wait, where is it? It's 12. That's not that many. <laughs> I'm not saving VOD. I'm gonna get in trouble. Save VOD for the night. Okay, I'll leave the VOD up till like my stream tomorrow. I'll, I'll leave the VOD up till my stream tomorrow, but after that I'm gonna take it down. Chrome is useless. I hate Chrome. I'm only using it because um, 